Hi everyone, my name is Tony Fox from Mrs Fox's Plans. Um, so today you're going to have to look at my ugly mush because I don't know how to set this camera up properly. I'm in my hotel room um, uh, in Pittsburgh where I'm staying while I'm visiting my son in America. I've done a little bit of um, shopping today at Hobby Lobby the cute little container I got for my grandson and I got a few little bits and pieces and so I thought I'd share them with you um, because some of this stuff we can't get in Australia and um, some of it's just pretty cute so I thought I'd share so this little plastic container obviously I'm going to give to my grandson but check out the little dinosaurs aren't they cute so the reason I have this is I needed something to carry all my stuff in so uh, this is an order from Fancy Plans Co. So I'll go through this in a minute. So we'll do the Hobby Lobby stuff first. Eh? So they um, had a sale on, um, uh, what's the brand? The brand is called, oh no, that's Happy Planner. It's Happy Planner. There's a brand, it's Happy Planner. I'm not doing too well here. Here they are. It's called, the paper studio that's where this is from so this is just a piece of a4 vellum so it was 99 cents which i thought was pretty cool then um i did get some happy planner stuff so i got some just some clear sleeves for my mini and um some just some cute lined paper and uh, these are expenses. These are for the, um, what do they call it? The half sheet. So what um, I'm going to have to do is crop it. So I just thought these were pretty good because they've got the, the date, the amount and stuff. So I just got some of those. Um, and I'll go through the sticker packs that I got. So uh, the, the Paper Studio was on sale. So I got uh, a little book of the alphabets. So $5.99, but it was 40% off. I got a, um, a little uh, mini sticker book. That was $4.99 at 40% off. It's got 15 sheets and 575 pieces so 575 little stickers so I'll get I'll cut them open and go through those there's another one this one's called nature so this is a bigger one obviously uh, and I have another one called the paper studio same company obviously this one is called alcohol ink I kind of like these because they've got like little alcohol ink swatches and the colors so there is different colorways in those so those are those books um what else did i get i thought these are um just from jim holtz they're just little uh frames this is for my um junk journal july so i needed some window frames I got this neat little cutter. It's called a paper cutter. It's a Fiskars paper cutter. So uh, the idea is for um, when you're cutting long bits of paper, so you slip it under there and you keep running along. That's what I believe it's for. So that's the demo. So I've not had one before. It was only $4.50, so I thought I'd give that a go some rubbish um i got this uh distress ink uh, container so this get this out so this is a distress ink little container so it holds uh 12 little containers so the reason i got this is because I discovered these. Because I just find, I don't know about you, but I just find that I don't get through the big ones quick enough. Um, 
and I just kind of thought maybe they were a bit of a waste. I don't know price-wise if this is any cheaper. I can't imagine. I don't know, if I'm honest. I actually do not know. But what I like about these is they fit in the little container. So I got two packs of those, two uh, of different colorways of those. I don't have any of these at the moment. So they're very interesting <laughs> names. I was laughing with the lady as I was checking out the names of these colors. So we have got Villainous Poison, Seedless Preserve, Shaded Lilac, Victorian Velvet, Antique Linen, which is, that's pretty straightforward. Vintage Photos, straightforward. Uh, Walnut Stain, pretty straightforward. Uh, black, black Spot, pretty straightforward. Uh, this little guy does not like to stay in its place. So there you go. Okay, so that's a those. Then what did I get? I got, um, I like uh, really pointy tweezers, but I find that I don't know about you, but I find myself getting stabbed all the time um, by my tweezers. So I saw these and they come with a little case and these are the reverse tweezers. So they're the, where you have to push in. So the good thing about these is if you're actually holding something, you can let it go. So if you're, you put your sticker on and then you can do whatever so I thought they were pretty cute and they have their own little case they are a, a singer brand which is basically a, um, a sewing brand they're called self-locking tweezers so oh uh, what other goodies have we got? I can't believe this, but have a look at the size of these. These are little scissors. Not sure if they work. Let's give it a try. They work. They're not fantastic, if I'm honest, but hey, cost a dollar. They're supposed to be like little portable scissors. I'm not 100% sure that they would get through the airport. I think these might be confiscated from you, but how could you not? How could you resist those? I oh, know. Um, okay. To go with my Distress uh, ink, I got the applicators. So I don't have any of these. They come with the whole bunch of pads. This is the uh, uh, Jim Holtz ones. So they're the little things. They've got a little Velcro on the bottom. So you put your little, little pad and then you obviously uh, put your distress ink. But the other good thing that I did get is these. These are little, um, uh, sandpaper discs so stick on there and they rough up your page so that's actually a pretty cool idea so I grabbed a packet of those sandpaper discs a sandy discs for $2.99 from Tim Holt so that's pretty cool. I might actually put all of the spare little... Oh, well, they're not going to fit. So I might have to put them in these little... The little um, space that I have spare. Oh, 
No, they're not going to fit. No, they won't fit, unfortunately. But the these things will. Just these guys oh, on their own. <laughs> All right, only two more things left, and then that is the finish. So this little container, I don't know how much, six ninety nine. This cost. So this obviously I'm going to leave behind. Uh, for my grandson but in the meantime I can uh, store all my stuff um, that I'm using and hopefully not collecting anymore because I don't think it'll fit in my luggage but we'll see okay so the only other thing that I got was these which I um, need for my cords. They're just um, things to hold your cords together. So they're great. So I just grabbed a handful of those, which I need. And of course, I got some glue. Now, this one. Okay, so it's like a pen. So the good thing about this is um, for really fine, really fine lines. So that's pretty good. That's the, um, what do you call it? The Zig, it's the Zig. Oh, what's it's up to Zig two-way, two-way glue. Squeeze and roll. Okay. Okay, so that's all of those little goodies. So, my box from Fancy Plans. So, what I, I ordered these because, um, I'm not sure if you know yet, but I have a um, excuse me from leaning across. I have my new everyday planner, which is my CP Petite. So, uh, I did get quite a few, um, which I'm not sure whether or not I'll just add. Okay, anyway, I got a few inserts for this. She's a little bit of a chunky monkey, but I, um, there's a few more things that I wanted. So I ordered some stuff from Fancy Plants. So this is what it is. So it's first time ever ordering from here. So this is my first ever order. So curious to see how I go. So we obviously get a card, a thank you card, and be sure to follow us, which I will, I'll tag you. And that's obviously my information. So I got um, some more aluminium discs. So I got these ones here, which I might as well find out from this what size they are. Uh, 24 mil and 32 mil. So the hot pink is 32 and the uh, grey metal is 24 mil. So it's a big difference between 24 and 32. So I'm going not sure so that's what they are um i got some um small grid i kind of like i mean this is like a greeny color grid so i'll i'm going to take those bags for those little ones so yeah so it's like a it's almost like a greeny colour, so I'll um, unroll these. They're actually quite nice. Grid, because I don't, I mean, I don't use a lot of washi, but grid is definitely something I use. This is pretty cool. This is a metal card. This says how to plan your day. So it's pretty cool. Prep, morning routine, brain dump. The big picture, prioritise, work your list, plan, plan ahead. It actually looks like it's got some marks on it. It's, all, it's really unusual. Not 
not sure if you can see, you can't really see that. Anyway, that's pretty cool. I like that. Uh, I got this uh, adorable little paper clip. That's, um, I only just got one, which is just so cute. Now this is interesting. This is a um, uh, uh, what do you call it? Uh, um, no. Hold on. So, it's got these little blades. You get these. Uh, where well, you get two of each. These little blades. So I assume how they work is you push them in, you open this up, um, okay, and then you push them in, and then you, oops, and I'm not sure. Without, without cutting myself. There we go. There we go. That's pretty cute. So that is those. So you've got this little container. I'll cut this up without stabbing myself. And a little thing in the bobby. So what I might do is get rid of this box. Maybe get rid of the box. Okay. So first of all, uh, this is a uh, memo board that you stick onto your monitor. So see how you've got this here. So you stick it across on your monitor, and then um, you can draw on it with um, a erasable pen. So this is what um, what I got this for. So this I'm not going to use this obviously till I get home. Stick it across my monitor, and then that way you can write things and do whatever you want. You can actually stick it this way if you want. So you can have it um, up down the side or across the top. So that's what that little guy is. I got a um, uh, page flag, I guess you could call it, a uh, um, divide, a page divider, a page marker, something like that. So for my uh, seed paper teats, this could go in anywhere. I've got a few things in here at the moment, so wow, it sticks up quite high. So pretty good so I got that and I got that in that color that I'm not sure I can't remember what the color is but I'll um, put all the details of everything that I got down below so if you want to know what the color is it's a bit like a caramelly color so what I will do is so what I I did because CP Petite is um, a specific size for cloth and paper being cloth and paper petite but it is a very much the same size as A6. So what I did was I got a bunch of A6 inserts and I got them unpunched so that I could punch them myself because I actually have a Levenger punch here so I can punch them myself. But I also have got my... Um, um, mini HP so this is um, at the moment it's just a cheap happy planner that I got from Walmart but it's um, going to be uh, more or less like a budget planner so I got some inserts to go with that 
So we'll go through those first. So I got a little um, uh, folder. So this is good because you could just stick um, receipts in it. So I got that so you could just stick little receipts in there. That's perfect. So I got a, a no spender challenge a budget. Uh, just got some plain note paper, some plain grid. Uh, this is um, some video planning checklist. And the really cool thing about this is it's got some prompts on the back, which I'm really keen to, to look at. Uh, social media calendar, which is great. That's perfect. And it's an expense. Tracker. I probably will have to get um, some more of these so I thought I'd try them first and if they were um, suitable and I was using them I'm going to grab some more so now I have got oh hang on there's one more an after pay tracker which is going to obviously go in with the finances so now I got a bunch of inserts for my CPPT so these are pretty cool tracker um i got uh inbox uh, i got self-care reflection so it's kind of like a bit of a journaling thing so i haven't looked at it yet but i certainly will a uh, progress tracker just some grid uh skincare a uh, routine oh i got a dashboard so i'll pull that out and i'll go through that with you so just got some notes with a coffee cup Again, some content planner, um, shopping list, uh, social social media stats tracker, uh, planner routine, a subscription tracker, daily routine, it's another tracker, uh, order tracker, uh, yearly habit tracker, uh, just a, a list another just a uh, lined note this one here has also got another kind of tracker on the back and here we have just a cute little crystals on top some fall note paper and i like the planes that this could be my travel notes so i got all of those and i did get some dashboards so i got these this is the uh mini HP uh, dashboard so I got that's kind of really cute and then I got an inbox one so it's got to do and top priority so um, I got these so that I could actually put some sticky notes on so that's for the mini HP and uh, last but not least I got the butterfly is only beautiful because the, the caterpillar is brave. And um, as you can see, I'm a big fan of butterflies. So that is beautiful. I don't know if you can see that. And then this one here is 100 things to track in your planner. 100 things to track in my planner. I don't have enough inserts, but that's pretty cool. I love that. So that, um, that will go in my uh, my mini CP petite. So I'll show you, I'll pull out, um, oh, here's an, here's a, um, an insert, a uh, CP petite insert, a cloth and paper insert, sorry. So um, as you can see, it is just fractionally longer than A6 but the A6 is just fractionally wider. So it's very, very similar. And I'm not overly stressed by um, the difference. So I uh, have a few other um, A6 inserts that I've just punched in here. So, um, and they, they're quite fine. They're just perfectly fine. So I'm going to have fun with hole punching all of this stuff and figuring out 
what I'm going to uh, put in my little CP. So at the moment, I've got it um, set up um, semi how I want it. And I was just waiting for these inserts to arrive so that I can make some changes and um, put some of these guys in there. And I think that I should be good for inserts, really. I don't think I need any more, just quietly. But I really like these ones because I really like the way they've got the polka dots. I think a couple of them I got a different different uh, thing on the um, the edge. That's just because I think that that's all that was available. But oh, thank you. I just love them. I just I love them. So I've got um, got lots of fun things to do. So these ones here, I might just, just have a look. These ones here. Oh, they're oh they're yearly trackers. But oh my goodness color symbol key yes they're yearly trackers I don't know if you can see that but, oh my god oh um I'll tell you how many pages you get in here you get one two three four five six seven eight you get eight so that's pretty cool well, I, um, that's it from me. I will um, talk to you really, really soon when I get all this set up. I just thought I'd do this. Um, again, sorry about the way the camera is, but at the moment my setup isn't great. But um, as soon as I figure out how to do a tabletop, I will do a, um, a go over my journal with you, my CP Petite and um, this guy. Talk to you soon. Um, if you um, like what you see, if you can give me a thumbs up and if you want to see more content, if you could subscribe and press that bell button and um, join in our little community, I'd really appreciate it. That's it for me for now. Ciao. Bye.